So, Graham, a one all draw tonight. What did you make of that game? It was a good game. It was a good test. Uh, it's brilliant to bring opposition of that standard up, uh, especially on, on the occasion of opening our stand. Um, but our boys got a good workout. Some of the first team players playing 90 minutes, John Flanagan getting 60 minutes in his recovery. It's great for us, and, and especially I think that uh, people can see our players having a contest and having a competition against that team. We were, we were out of our comfort zone for a long time tonight, which was really, really good. And you've created some good chances as well. That must be pleasing for you. It is pleasing because we know we've got players who can damage opponents, um, even opponents of this standard. Um, we have to do it more often. We have to actually go and play against people of this calibre to stress our players in a, state, in a safe way. We have to get them out of their, their comfort zone, as I've said, but we have to make sure they understand we want them to struggle. We want them to be stressed. We want them to be challenged, not because we don't rate them, but because we do, we want them to actually go and reach that next level and, and meet the standard of the players in front of them. Um, and because if they do that, they can go and challenge for a first team position. And we want our players to continue to grow and develop and, and, and to move on from where they are currently to improve and get better, because ultimately it'll serve them well in their career. Mm -hmm. And at the other end, the defence was well organised and Andy Firth had some good saves as well. We've got Philip Alanda, you've got... Um, Lewis Mayo learning from him all the way through. Andy Firth obviously is a first-team goalkeeper, dropping in, giving us experience, giving us good communication and showing our players that the first-team standard of organisation that we need to get to. And, and they can only learn from that. And I thought that fair play to Chelsea, they came and gave us a really, really good test. Even with all the players that we had out there, it was a good tussle for us. And, and when you go 1-0 up, you hope to hold on. But I thought a draw was about fair. Yeah, and you mentioned it a little bit there, but it was some important minutes for some players as well. Yeah, yeah it's Philip's first 90 minutes since he's come to the football club, so he said he was a bit tired, and, and he will be, but we needed to make sure that it was a proper, meaningful game, um, not just an occasion to open, open the stand, although it was a good occasion, we needed to make sure it was a proper game, and I thought Chelsea came with a good attitude, with good quality, uh, and caused us some problems, so that's the kind of game we want. Those are the standard of players that we want to play against, and our players enjoyed it, and, and they're, they're a bit fatigued in the change room right now. Yeah, and just a little bit on the stand, how good is it going to be to have a facility like that here? It's awesome. Uh, I mean, it's good to see it full for the first day, but we need people to come and fill it every single game we have. The changing rooms in there are great because we've got we've got linked TV, which we can do our changing room meetings in there. We can show them everything. We can leave our set players on a roll, on a loop for the players to keep on and know where they're going. And it's just given us a, a new level of facility at the, at the football club um, that we're really, really grateful for. And I think the players really enjoy playing in front of it.